Welcome back everyone to day number two of the Novena Holy Saturday. Great to see you. And today, Janelle, we are praying for who? Uh, it says, today bring to me the souls of priests and religious and immerse them in my unfathomable mercy. It was they who gave me strength to endure my bitter passion. Through them, as through channels, my mercy flows out upon mankind. Mm. Got some thoughts? Yep, I certainly do. Okay. <laughs> so the first thought was this. Um, we have so much to be thankful for, for our priests and religious, religious consecrated people. Um, first off, we wouldn't have the Eucharist. And we wouldn't um, be able to hear the words of absolution without our priests, mm -hmm. have the sacrament of reconciliation. Um, I even think of like the impact that religious sisters have had on my life and on my faith formation throughout the years, even though we don't actually live in a community where there's a lot of, a, a lot mm -hmm. of sisters um, currently here. But at the same time, they have left their mark and even in society. And I think, you know, even the gift of divine mercy was brought to us through St. Faustina, mm -hmm. who was a religious. Mm -hmm. So those are my thoughts. Okay. For me, I think about kind of thinking about what's going on in the state of the church regarding the clerical sex abuse crisis. And right away, we think about mm -hmm. the priests. And I, I don't know if you feel bothered by all of this, but um, we certainly do. We've done videos on this. But we are sort of, it seems like, a little bit in darkness right now. We haven't got a lot of response from the prelates in the church or the church hierarchy. We just kind of, things have just continued on and there's been really no plan of action. In one sense, we're sort of in darkness regarding this. Not a lot has happened. And it is on this day, Holy Saturday, where the apostles find themselves in darkness. Jesus is laid in the tomb and they're just kind of waiting. They don't know what's happening. They don't know what's happening next. In one sense, I feel like, sort of like the church right now. We don't know what's happening next. What's the solution? How are we going to get out of this? I don't know. But I think it's going to have something to do with Jesus Christ and the power of his resurrection. How that's going to look, I don't know. But I think that's where we're at. The church is sort of in a holy Saturday right now. Hmm. And in my travels, I'd have to say, I have met many wonderful, wonderful priests. I'm a, a full-time Catholic lay evangelist. I've been speaking full-time for the last 20 years. And I just got off a very busy stretch where I left Janelle alone with our five kids. <laughs> and I have to say, I'm in and out of parishes. And I, I want to encourage you, if you're wondering, like, what are priests out there thinking? I just wanted to say, the priests, there's great priests out there. They're holy. They're men who have sacrificed their life. They've given up worldly pleasures. They've given pledged obedience, taken vows of obedience to their bishops to serve Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. And I'm getting the sense that some of them they're not giving up, but some of them feel a little discouraged. They're not going to give up. They're good, holy men. And what we need to do is we need to pray for them. Because if you really want to support the priesthood, the best way, we give us some words of affirmation to them, but then pray for them because mm -hmm. they need our prayers right now. Mm -hmm. They need our prayers. And I think of how the priesthood has blessed my life, mm -hmm. transformed my life. Like how so? baptism, mm -hmm. sanctifying grace. I'm a child of God. Receive the body and blood of Jesus Christ in the Eucharist at his hands. I think the priest is the most powerful person in the world. Mm -hmm. It's not the president of the United States. I hate to break it to you, my American friends. Mm -hmm. it's, it's the priest, the Catholic priest who has the power to transform a sinner into a saint. Through his words of absolution. By calling upon mm -hmm. Jesus to come on the bread and wine and it becomes God. Heaven touches down in our, in our churches. Mm -hmm. um, I think about... My brother, uh, he's a priest, and I just, I just, it moves me when I, th I think about it. How he just, he, his nose hit the floor of the cathedral, and when I saw him lying there, it was just something. I heard the Lord just speak in my heart, just like things are gonna. He, what did he? Say? I felt like his things are gonna change in your family. Like his, his priesthood brings salvation to people, including our immediate family. And I just, w what a gift. So, my friends, we're, we're in a time where there's great attack uh, on, on the priests. Mm -hmm. So let's rise up and let's pray for them. Let's pray for them. Any additional thoughts? No. I don't. <laughs> Sorry. That's okay. Let's pray. <laughs> the Chaplet of Divine Mercy 
In the name of the the Father, Father, Son, and the Holy Holy Spirit. Spirit. Amen. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. 
Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.